While tire and vehicle manufacturers specify if winter tires are applied to the front axle of any vehicle, they must also be installed on the rear. Some drivers still doubt the industry's stipulation of matching winter tires all the way around. To address those doubts and demonstrate what can happen when mixed tires reach their limits on hard packed snow and ice, we installed a pair of Bridgestone's Blizzak WS70 winter tires on a Civic's front axle with Taranza EL400 all-season tires on the rear. The front-wheel drive Civic equipped with mixed or matched tires ran equivalent straight-line acceleration times since both had Blizzak WS70 winter tires on their drive axle. While matching winter tires took 35.1 feet to stop the Civic, the mixed tires needed 40 feet. While front tires do most of the braking, the rear tires reduce traction, increase straight line stopping distance by about 12%. In order to compare cornering traction, we duplicated a normal 90 degree corner on the ice rink. The matching winter tires reached 11 miles an hour as they completed the corner without hitting any cones. However, when the Civic equipped with mixed tires attempted to go around the corner at the same speed, the all-season tires on the rear couldn't provide enough traction to prevent the driver from losing control as the car spun out. Even Honda's vehicle stability assist could not restrain the vehicle when the tires were mismatched. Why gamble with your winter tire selection when four of a kind always beats two pair? Research, buy, deliver, install.